Okay, from our previous uh, operation, you should have drawn um, eight of these triangles, as described, all the way around. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to take our uh, poplar staters and square them up and glue them down. And this is, uh, and uh, what I'm using is just the five minute epoxy again. I'm going to mix up just enough to. Uh, do one at a time, and we want these really square, so take your time and, uh, and get these nice and square. Um, I put a pretty generous amount of glue on the back side here. And uh, I'm using uh, the one, two, three blocks to, uh, to keep it squared up. <clears throat> But whatever method you're using, make sure it's square. And I'm going to put it right on the line, uh, allowing for making sure on the back side over here, there's at least a quarter inch from our, our circle that we drew. And uh, so you put it right on the line so I can see the line. I can see that it's nice and uh, lined up with that. And then... Uh, and then hold it square. You can use a regular square. Um, just make sure that uh, you know it. That when it dries, it's it's nice, nice and square. We're actually going to reinforce these uh, uh, a little later uh, with some fillets in here, some wood fillets that are going to uh, make this uh, very strong structure. Uh, but for right now, we're we're going after um, the squareness. And so go ahead and uh, do those one at a time. Like I said, take your time. We want these to be really square. We don't want uh, uh, don't think these going zigzagging all over the place. And uh, if you're not careful, they will. Okay. All right, so go ahead and do that in eight places, and I'll see you in the next section.